it, I feel it. I want it and I need it, so I give it to myself without permission. Listen, call it intuition. Tap me into my inner wisdom. Living well, manifest from my wishing well. Then I wish you well, smiling like a show and tell. You know I love myself. Self love, yeah, this a show to tell. It's the best love. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Misty Beauty, and I'm here to do another general energy reading. I hope that all of you guys are doing well. So, um, let's go ahead and jump into the reading. Well, before we jump into the reading, I want to say hey to all of my new love bugs. And then also, if you are new to this channel, you guys, we here on our channel have something called Mystic Bee's Honey Pot Blessing Raffle. It is a blessing raffle, you guys. The tickets are $1.11. You can find the link to the raffle in the description box. How it goes is every week we do a computer-generated raffle. The raffle picks one person, and that person wins the pot. Okay. All right. I'm super, super excited. Every time we get to bless someone with, with cash and especially with it being so close to the holidays, I'm super excited, it's particularly this month, you know, just love to be a blessing to someone, you guys. So if you guys want to participate, the link is in the description box. Or if you just want to be a blessing, the tickets are only $1.11. The link is in the description box. Also, you guys, our chosen ones, um, boxes are now available on my Etsy shop. You guys go ahead and grab yours before they're gone. I I put in these boxes the Moon Goddess Bath, our Ritual Candles, you guys, our Jinx Removing Oil. No, I'm sorry. This is the Jinx Removing Oil. Our Jinx Removing Oil that I made and the Black Salt. That's for protection for your home. The Sage Bundle, the Sage Incense. The banish that bitch clearing spray for your home, for your it, for your for your surroundings, as well, along with a lot of other nice things. Um, also, Millie Millie's daughter is the subscriber um, sponsored product in the box this month. You guys, look at that! Isn't that beautiful? Her body butter smells so amazing, and she sent over a bunch of them for this month's box. That is just, you know, my way of um, giving back to you guys as well. You know, giving you guys the opportunity to shine, you know, to showcase your products, to showcase your small business, you guys. So if any of you guys are interested in um, go ahead and getting your chosen ones box for this month, the link is in the description box on my Etsy shop. All right, so just starting off, you guys, um, the Three of Cups is here with the Death card. So this is letting me know that this this connection ended over a third party situation, just off dump. Okay, there was an ending due to someone having multiple partners. Okay, this also brought an end to the celebration between you guys. I feel like things could have been really good. It was like it was good until it wasn't good anymore between you guys, and I just feel like you know the fact that someone decided to celebrate with other people caused some type of ending um to this connection all right spirit what do you mean of the message thank you king of cups so you know this is someone who has a lot of love for you like i can't i just feel like this person has an awful amount of love for you but they sabotage the situation with a karmic energy this queen of wands in reverse okay this is someone who's very vengeful very aggressive this is someone who could have this this queen of wands in reverse could have sabotaged this connection for you guys 
just saying this this is someone who's very manipulative this is someone who's also known to be like a dark witch or something like that so your person could have been under the influence of spell work and they didn't know it um i feel like both of them may be watching you at this time your person is definitely watching you for sure with this page of swords energy you guys these are my easy tarot cards these cards teach you the meaning of tarot and the upright and in the reverse these are also available on my etsy shop as well for any of you guys that's looking to learn how to read tarot okay so the ace of cups in the world card so this person has an awful amount of love for you like this person desperately wants to give you some type of offer okay but they feel like that you feel like it's over they feel like you know some type of cycle has come, came to a complete completion between you guys you know they're desperate for some type of re reconciliation yeah, this person is desperate for some type of reconciliation. Clarify um, what's going on. What is going on with this Queen of Wands in reverse spirit? What is going on with this Queen of Wands in reverse? Thank you. Yeah, delay messages. Impulsive, hasty, and addictions. Your person could have been addicted to some type of Queen of Wands in reverse. And this, this situation or this person, this energy caused some type of delayed communication between you and your person. Yeah, look at that. Three of Wands. This is why you guys were waiting. This is why this person had you in this Three of Wands energy because they were, they were entertaining a karmic energy. I almost said a Jezebel. They were entertaining a Jezebel spirit. Yes, they were. I don't know why I feel like they got caught up with this person or something like that. They definitely got caught up with this person. Tell me more, Spirit. What else went on? Yeah. there's This whole situation has caused a major um, imbalance in your person's life right now. Like, this person is extremely emotionally unbalanced right now because of the separation between you guys. And the fact that this person was having a hard time making some type of decision, this person is emotionally imbalanced, okay? They're, they are emotionally unstable right now. What else? Thank you. Yeah, I feel like... See, the thing is, this person feel like they invested a lot of time in you as well. It's like they invested a lot of time in this connection with you and then they went off to be with like another person. There was some type of an investment. This person also view you as the investment as well. It's like they started off investing in you. They invested all these years into you. You invested all these years into this person and then they went off and started trying to invest somewhere else and they didn't receive anything out of that situation. Seven of Swords. I can't make this shit up. Deceit, betrayal. It talks of deceit, betrayal. Someone strategizing, very cunning type of energy. This person was juggling you. They juggled you with a Jezebel type of energy. A very seductive, all about sex, lustful type of connection with they, that they had with somebody. This person is coming out as a coward, okay? This person, they were a coward for what they did to you. This person could have, I heard they ran and they hid. This person did something dirty to you. I feel like they were misguided to do so by a situation that was going to break up anyway. It was, it was, it was destined for them and this karmic energy to split up, okay? Um, this was like a karmic soulmate. That they were dealing with this was not the real deal okay this was this wasn't a divine partnership this was like a karmic soulmate someone that was supposed to teach them some type of lesson okay so this person was just they were refusing to face judgment they were refusing to examine themselves for a long time you know this talks about an inability to face a problem head on, failing to make some type of decision, failing to go through some type of judgment. Okay, this person was failing to make a decision between you and this other person because the lovers is here and it talks about a choice to be made in between relationships, a dilemma. Okay, and temptation. This person fell into temptation 
and this 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 queen of wands is known to be very vengeful as well you guys a very vengeful type of energy so they just was in over their head they didn't know what they were dealing with who they were dealing with when they was dealing with this karmic energy what else spirit thank you this person wants marriage with you though i feel like after seeing the truth of this situation with this queen of wands in reverse look that this queen of wands was a snake sneaky okay now this person is wanting some type of marriage with you yeah they're they are being divinely guided to come towards you thank you this person also wants babies with you but you guys like look at that skating you guys are trying to skate right out of this person's life and they feel that you know this person is saying that you're special to them though and this person is seeking guidance. They're talking to a psychic or they're, they've gotten a tarot card reading or something on you. Or you may read tarot, but I'm really feeling like this person um, received some type of spiritual insight on what to do with this connection or like how to win you back or what's going on with your life or something like that. Um, you are in this now or never type of energy, last chance. Like this, this is it's now or never for this person to get it together. I want more moments with you. So this person is wanting to spend more time with you. You haven't saw this person in a while, though. For some of you guys, it's been like over a year if you have not saw this person. They were dealing with another person. Look at that. That's why they were in and out your life. They was dealing with this person was dealing with a Jezebel energy. They were dealing with a very toxic female feminine energy, like a female fatal type of energy okay very snaky that's why this snake came out when i said they learned who this person this person is a snake and i don't know why spirit just gave me the vision of a bunch of eggs in this snake's belly so this person they could have got the snake pregnant as well you know snakes birth more snakes you know so i don't know so chosen is here and promises so this person wants to choose you they want to choose you but they still have this dilemma you think this person is childish with this ring pop for this promise card you think this person is childish and look this is why your back is turned this person's back is turned from this ring you think this is a childish ass offer you think this person is immature you guys is a ring pop so you don't trust this person's you don't trust them at all. You think they're very childish. You think they're very immature. And you think this person is just trying to control the situation. Yeah. Some of you guys are just taking a break from this person. You feel like you need a break because you feel like this person is hiding something from you. Yeah. Look at that. Hard to figure out. Okay. You feel like this person is hard to figure out. This person has options or they had options in the past. And this is why this person was ghosting you. This is why they, they were in and out of your life because they had options. Just saying. All right, Spirit, go ahead and give me some um, final messages before I take this over to the extended. You guys, I'm going to extend the video. I'm going to see what you don't see coming. Should you wait on this person? Um what is this person's next move like what do they plan on doing okay all right spirit. i'm gonna pull some more energy for their heart space i want to know exactly how this person feel about you what they've been keeping from you all right spirit ace of pinnacle justice mm. For some of you guys, this person could be married. I'm hearing this person could be like in some type of marriage. This King of Wands talks about this is a, a, a this person was a player. So, you guys, I'm gonna finish this over on extended. I'm gonna continue to talk about these cards. I'm gonna pull more cards. We're just gonna get into it. All right, I love you guys. You guys are awesome. And peace.